everyone, I'm Power Stars, and this is Tales of Gaming. Team Fortress 2 is one of those games that has a way of sucking all your time away from you, and it is, by far, one of the most addicting games I've ever played. But it was originally going to be a lot different. So today, I'm telling you about a proposed prototype, Team Fortress 2, Brotherhood of Arms. Now, there are only two pictures of this to show, so while I talk, I may resort to using images of other beta versions of the game, the original, or TF2 memes. Mostly TF2 memes. Anyways, as you can see from this magazine article, it would have been a lot more realistic than the final, more like the original. But the gameplay would have been completely different. For one thing, more unrealistic aspects, such as rocket jumping, would be removed, and realistic tactics would have to be used in order to win. The classes were the ones we were familiar with, but with different names, and some gameplay differences. For instance, the spy would choke enemies to death rather than backstabbing them. There were also three new classes. The instructor was a bot who taught players how to play the game. The officer would lead the players in an attack and charge them into the enemy base. And the commander would be the most important class in the game. He would be able to see the entire map as well as issue orders in real time and control squads of players. The game was eventually scrapped but then revived for the awesome one we have today. And I wouldn't want it any other way. Well, I'm Power Stars, and this was Tales of Gaming. Like, subscribe, comment, the usual. I'll see you all next time.